We're coming up on the anniversary, the 90th anniversary of the most destructive tornado in recorded American history. It happened on March 18th, 1925. I'm looking for survivors. Now they would be quite old at this time, but uh, some people who are up into their 90s can still be quite sharp or a close family member, maybe a son or a grandson or daughter, a granddaughter especially Griffin, Indiana, which was virtually flattened by this storm. You can get in touch with me at kayorpert at wthitv.com or 232-4953, area code 812, or by using our reported feature at wthitv.com. I'd like to hear from you because I want to recount the story. I want to hear this living history uh, before, you know, everybody's gone who uh, has any sort of connection with that. So here we have Highway 50. It runs right through uh, Clay County and Richland County and Lawrence County and then Knox and Davies and Martin counties. And this is what I'm talking about right in through here. This is where the winter weather advisory is in effect tonight through tomorrow morning. And this is where we will be getting the heavier amounts of snow. Even up into Green County, it looks as though uh, we could get uh, slightly heavier amounts, and that's the reason I put Green County in the up to three inch category. Vincennes, two to four inches. Around Terre Haute here and so on, looks like it's probably going to be an inch or less. Now, these could vary a little bit as far as uh, accumulations go, but I think this is a, a fairly good estimate of what we can expect. Here's a look at the Storm Team 10 storm tracker. You can see where the heavier snow is, and you saw Stidman. He was standing out there, and it's just coming down like crazy. And so now we take a look at the clouds and the radar, and again, we see how most of this is farther to the south, and you go even farther south near the Ohio River, and they're getting a whole lot more snow than even those of us who are going to be in Knox County or Davies County or those areas. 19, that's the low for the day. Casey 20, Robinson 21, Vincennes has 21 degrees. So the wind now from the northwest at 14 miles per hour. No wonder I can't get warm today. Uh, northwest wind in Robinson, north in Vincennes at 15, and Paris 14. Here's a look at the Storm Team 10 future cast. This is midnight tonight, takes this snow mostly out of here, and then that opens the door for gradually warmer temperatures, not right away, but gradually warmer. And as we get into the weekend, some pretty nice weather. Now, an overnight low tonight of eight, higher accumulation to the south as far as several inches of snow possible. And then for tomorrow, becoming sunny, but much colder. High tomorrow of 16. Tomorrow night, clear, very cold. Could be one degree below zero. Okay, Suze, here you go. Is there a number there you see in that seven-day forecast that appeals to you?